Lorraine Sink here at the press line, waiting for the actors to come out of Hall H from the big, huge Marvel Studios panel. Check it out. You just blew all of our minds oh, good. with everything that happened in Hall H. I want to know what were you most excited to share because you've been sitting on a lot of information. Yes, I, I was excited about all of it. I was excited about sharing all of Phase 4. You're right, people have been asking us for years, what's next, what's happening, we said after Endgame, after Far From Home, and now here we are unveiling uh, a number of projects over the next two years as Phase 4. Uh, and it feels good to finally have it out there and have people know. Why did you feel Marvel Studios' Black Widow was the right film to kick off Phase 4? Because she's a character that everybody thinks they know everything about. And she's been in so many of our movies, and you know bits of it, but in no way do you know the whole story. Finally, Marvel Studios' Black Widow, it's happening. How does it feel for you to finally be at the helm of your own film? It's pretty surreal. I mean, honestly, it's, it feels so raw right now because we just got off a plane yesterday from London and we're flying back tonight after all this work to go back and actually complete or keep, continue on this process. We have a while to completion. Welcome to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. I know. What does, it, what does it mean to you to be part of this huge galaxy? I don't know. Everybody keeps saying, what does it mean? I haven't quite put my finger on it because the last hour has honestly been like the biggest and most amazing, but blur. It, I mean, I was in whole age and, and the, I couldn't even see the back of the room. There were so many people that were just so eager and, and so, um, touch to see all of their heroes on stage and that for me was equally an amazing thing to be a part of. It's kind of unbelievable. I keep on wondering like what kind of parallel universe I'm in and where the normal me is supposed to be. No, this because, is you. Uh, this is You're really my life. Six. <laughs> what is it like for you to step up into this big literal universe? Well, I, I feel like I'm walking into mythology. Uh, and folklore and incredible storytelling and actually being backstage today there's so many actors that I've worked with in the past like incredible actors they really hire very talented people. The scripts are so good, the characters are so good, the directors, Kate Shortland is so good, the movies are all so unique in and of themselves. Black Widow is in a way a departure, I mean it feels almost like an espionage movie, it's got these, all these elements to it. This film is really grounded, it's very, it's a little dirty, um, it's a little salty. I like all of that. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's like bringing some realness to the Marvel Universe. What can you tell us about your character, because things are still so shrouded in mystery, but we want to know. So Melina um, has been, my character has been cycled through the Red Room five times through the Widow program. What can you tell me about Mason? Well, you know, he's uh, a, a fixer, you know, he kind of is a, and I, I think, yeah, generally he can help people get the things which are hard to get and uh, hide things and find things and, um, and he's got a complex relationship with Natasha. What can you tell us about Alexei? Well, I mean, he's the Red Guardian who is, um, you know, in the comics, uh, in the Cold War, the, the arms race was happening and America was developing nuclear weapons, the Russians were developing nuclear weapons, and America developed uh, this thing called Captain America. And so the Russians responded in, in, in retaliation with something called uh, the Red Guardian, uh, Alexei Shostakov. The last month of shooting has been the coolest and the most uh, surreal experience and, and to play a woman like her and to play opposite a woman like Natasha. Um, it's just so cool to see two women, I suppose, like equals, and um, and 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 I'm excited. Presenting that footage today was a it was a literal dream come true. And there you have it, 2020. I cannot wait. Uh -huh.